Well, we start this afternoon with economic inclusion. That's all one local business wants. Dick Davis's contract was not renewed with the city of Omaha. He was in charge of helping small businesses land contracts with the city. But as Deborah Tuff explains, the city didn't renew because of poor performance and Davis has numbers to prove they're wrong. Deb. Was it personal? Davis hopes not. And with Preston Love Jr. and Councilman Ben Gray behind him. He says numbers don't lie. Take a look at this. In five years, Davis says 75 bidders submitted $45 million in bids. 45 of those businesses received $30 million in contracts. More so, 35 firms required $60 million in bonds, and none of them lost those same bonds. David has also produced a detailed audit of the companies he worked with over the past five years. You're looking at video from the $2 billion sewer project in North O. Now, when asked if he'd be open to getting a new contract with the city, Davis said, quote, he doesn't get mad at money, end quote. If we work together as a community and, 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 and tap into all of the intellectual capital that we have in Omaha, uh, we could fix this. Now, Councilman Gray says the mayor can't move on from the issue and he won't let her. So what did the mayor say? I reached out to her office this morning. So far, no word back. But in the past, one of her concerns, new people had not enrolled and the program had not grown. For Action 3 Midday, I'm Deborah Tuff. Deb, thank you. Residents in the North